excited to be here. I'm here for a photo shoot working with Crystal Creative Shots. I've worked with her in the past before. And to also see Lauren. This is the first time seeing her apartment here. I haven't seen her in almost a year. Literally the last time I saw her was Hangout Fest and that was last May. Crazy. But this morning has been wild. Literally woke up at like 2 a.m. or 3, 2, 3 a.m. to get on our flight that left at 6 a.m. this morning. We've got a long day ahead. Got a little bit of sleep on the way here but we're now on our way to Lawrence. Hello, New York. Hello, New York. <laughs> the enthusiasm. Look who's here. I haven't even introduced you to the vlog yet. And we are about to go to a little cafe to get some coffee and breakfast, a little snack before our shoot today at one. Marley and Elle. It's lemonade? Yeah, just lemonade. Oh my gosh, oh my it's so cute. I mean, it is so adorable. Yeah. yeah. I like it. That looks good on the head. I think it does too. Do you like it, Maddie? She's just nervous at see-through. Not enough to go. All the time, but someday my prince will come. But if this ain't love, then I don't want it.
in the forest. Oh my god, she almost fell. As you see, the peers do stand and watch. Don't pay any attention to them. As you see, she gracefully glides across the sidewalk. So beautiful, so ready for her mate. Since the wild influencer did not get the shot she needed, she is now having to go back into the street, risking her own life in front of the vehicles. No way, I just missed that. I just missed that. Cherry blossoms, oh my god, and like everywhere else around New York today. It's kind of the whole reason why we're here. Well, I'm here. What's our plan? I feel still asleep. Hello everyone, we are now in Central Park. She's getting her photos done over there. I just got mine done. We are Princess Peach up in this house. I'm not mad about it. How oh, the sun be out and about.
Good morning, everyone. Happy Saturday. Um, I'm getting ready for the day. It is about 11.30, and Dawson and I have lunch reservations at 1 in Deep Ellum. I'm working with a restaurant down there. It's my favorite restaurant. One of my favorite Mexican restaurants, Fedora. And I'm like, oh my gosh, they want to work with me? <sighs> say no more so we are going today and back whenever they had reached out they're like what day and time can you go and i was like oh like a lunch idea would be so fun like during saturday because it's in deep ellum like we can go around like go go to lunch have lunch and then we can do a little bar hopping shindig it is storming like full on storm not just like raining like lender lender <laughs> thunder lightning everything so like well that just kind of puts a damper on things but it's fun. They're wanting me to promote their shareables, which is their like shareable drinks. And I said, in my head, I didn't actually say this, but I'm like, there's only two of us going. You want us to split your shareable? I mean, I know we can share, but like usually from what I've seen, whenever I'm there, there's like at least three people sharing this thing. Y'all, this margarita is huge. I'm excited though, like it'll be fun even though it's going to be storming and gross and rainy. I have no idea what I'm wearing yet because I kind of just want to go like with leggings. Something like cute but like casual because of the rain, but I don't know yet. I spent so long on Pinterest yesterday trying to come up with an outfit and I got nothing. But Dawson will be here in about 45-ish minutes. I've got some time. And then we'll be heading our way downtown. Also update, y'all are the first ones to know about this so y'all should feel so honored um i signed a lease for an apartment and i move i get keys next friday what i know i know i've been keeping on the deal well actually it literally came out of nowhere like i saw this deal at this building that i've been dying to live at for a while like there's so many buildings in dallas that i've been dying to live at okay but this is one of them and i was like oh my gosh this floor plan is available like i need to take it now and it was at such a good price and i was like shut up say no more so i contacted them and they're like oh yeah this is available at um this one price which was like 200 dollars more than what it said on apartments.com and i was like mm -mm -mm -mm. i could respond back i said according to apartments.com it said it was for um this price can you honor that They're like oh that's for immediate move-in i said oh crap because i really wasn't planning on moving for like another month i was like you know what i should just do it so i was like okay i'll move in <laughs> so literally within like two days i signed my or i like turned in my security deposit signed my lease set up everything like we're good to go so in less than a week that is so insane so that's really exciting i am so pumped it is she's a corner unit mm. so yep there's that little life update did i tell you after lunch and stuff today we're going to dawson's and uncle's and we're gonna have like dinner his sister's in town so we're gonna have some dinner with them i've never met his aunt and uncle yet like i haven't that didn't make sense i have yet to meet his aunt and uncle and so that'll be fun yeah that's our plan for today but yeah i've been loving that these restaurants have been reaching out to me because i've been i've been wanting to do this for a while like i want to review restaurants here in dallas give y'all like the lowdown like if i like it or not like what to get what not to get that sort of thing and i don't know these just started coming out of nowhere and i was like all right let's do it here we are doing the dang thing but yeah i'm gonna finish getting ready figure out what the heck i'm wearing and i will see y'all once dawson gets here I wasn't lying when I said how big this was. It's rather large. <laughs> I could not. Is it good? Very, actually really good. Yeah, good.
black coffee. I rate it? Yeah. Mm. 7 2 You can try my macchiato. Oh, it's traditional oh, I will. macchiato. Yeah, it's not big. Starbucks, like she said. <laughs> they always make a point to say that, so I just like went ahead and was like, I know it's the traditional kind. Yeah. Like, oh, you want it like a latte? No. Can you see it? No one knows. Starbucks is. Well, it's pouring rain. It's had a huge margarita. That literally was just the juice. It, yeah, it might have been no. It, it would have been a virgin large margarita. It probably was. <laughs> because it was free. For us. <laughs> For us. We should have gone with the, the the flight. It's frozen. Yeah. Wasn't no. There was not frozen ones though. Well, why didn't we do that? I I drove. <laughs> I had four shots of Don Julio, I would have to Uber home. <laughs> no, we would have shared it. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess we've been fine. He ordered me a tequila shot before we left. Okay, to be fair. We were trying to tip our waitress. Trying to tip our waitress, and then she was, after I ordered the shot, she was like, oh, I'm leaving, so you guys can't tip me unless you have cash. Like, I don't have cash. Can we just tip some random people that we've never even spoke to? Pecan pie? I love me some pecan pie. Have a lot of red pie. Oh, I do. Miss Only Child. <laughs> he doesn't like Taco Bell. He doesn't like McDonald's. I don't. I don't. You don't like. There's something else. I'm sorry, I don't should. like putting cancer in my body. <laughs> okay, but he likes Wendy's. Into your food. Is okay. Is Wendy's better? Uh, no, but Wendy's is like a once a year, very hungover. But you still God. eat it. Okay, like. I'm not saying that I eat Taco Bell every day. Do you not? If I were to pick a fast food, it would be Wendy's. Um, if you're located in the West Coast or Texas, it would be In-N-Out. 100%. Oh, I like In-N-Out. I love In-N-Out. I've grown to like it. And Cane's. Cane's, Cane, those are my top three. It's so great. Okay, you're just jealous you didn't get invited to the first one. I am a little. Yeah. But that's not because <laughs> yeah. I've always been. I've always Yo, shout out Campaign. He got invited and I went with him. You she went didn't there? go. Wow. <laughs> did you get to meet Post Malone? No, he did though. How did you not get to meet him? I didn't go. I got invited. So you lied? Yeah. I couldn't go. I got invited and I legit couldn't go. Yo, Cam, if you're watching. I mean, you did invite me, so I can't really get mad at you, but I'm jealous that you gotta be the one. Even though you did nothing wrong. <laughs> Yo, this is pretty good. This is so much in there. You can have some of mine. I don't want any of that. You know what's really good? It's like didn't even a nice little bit of this so on top of that. Would you like that? No. Okay, I take that one. Really? Yeah. Wait. If you say so. Perfect. I'm such a nice girlfriend. She is. Takes me to it's lunch. Good. I got you a free shot. Yeah, I was about to say, he Out got of my me wallet. a free shot. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pretty good Wait, shot. You put it down pretty good though, I'm not gonna lie. I got documentation of it, you wanna see that? True. Key in three, two, one. <laughs> yeah. I'll take it at the end of the hashtag. <laughs> you started the recording? Dear Madison. <laughs> oh, that was weird. That was so weird. It's not best cow. No, it's not. She'll pass amigos. No, it's not even that bad. You're fine. Yep. Fine. Easy money. Nice. <laughs> See? She put it down pretty good, didn't she? Oh, bro. I didn't take one because I'm driving and I'm responsible. Oh, okay. Hashtag safety. Hashtag safety. This man pees like it's his job. Me, on the other hand, 
I have a bladder of a freaking, I don't know, camel. I never pee, and he pees all the time. What? I was telling them how much you pee. Bro, there's a code thing on it. I don't feel like asking them for the code. Oh. Do you want me to ask? No, it's fine. I can do it. I'm gonna do it. Big boy. I believe in you. Thanks. He did it. <laughs> It is the next day. It is Sunday morning and I'm getting ready for church. Last night was seriously so much fun. I didn't film anything at Dawson's aunt and uncle's because like it was literally the first time I've met him, met them and so, like, I'm not gonna film there. It was a lot of fun. We had tacos and we had like a little, we played a little card game. Yeah, I got home around like nine-ish last night and I was so tired. I was like, I'm going to bed. Good night, everybody. But yeah, it is about 9.50. Dawson is on his way here. We're actually going to Fellowship today, which is the church that my parents have been going to for the last like 20 plus years. Not 20 plus, 20 years? A while. <laughs> um, and so, because I guess like some guy is going to be like a guest speaker there and I was like, I need to go listen to him. So we are going there today instead of Shoreline. And so he's meeting me here and then we're going. And then after that, we are having a little cookout, grill out type of thing. Wendell's making his famous steaks. And so he's like, Dawson needs to try my steak. And that's what we're doing. <laughs> it's a much nicer day than it was yesterday. Thank goodness. Literally it was pouring rain yesterday. My hair was a mess. Like I literally got back from our lunch and I'm like, we we're going to have to stop by my house because my hair looks like I just, it just looks so bad. So I had to end up putting it in a clip, which was fine. But now I'm having to recurl it because it, I mean, it was torrential down for. I'm wearing a little, my green blazer outfit. I wore this in New York um, for photos, but it's like with this, it's from Buddy Love. So freaking cute. Um, and with this blazer, so it's like a little little set. Y'all, low key, I kinda wanna go dark with my hair. I am, <laughs> me and my hair journey of just going back and forth from one thing to the next is really just so out of hand, but whatever it's oh 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 it's just now that i've like lightened it like this one girl that i went to for the girl that i have now like put permanent dye in my hair and so it's been a process trying to like overpower that with the blonde so it just makes it look a little orangey and i don't know i just think darker suits me just a little bit better not like dark dark but you know darker than it is now i might have us go by i am so hungry right now like, I could go for a snackaroo. I might do a little Starbucks pickup order. So then we could get, like, breakfast and, like, a drink or something. So I'm hungry. Oh, my whole Oh, my soul. We're doing hometowns, hometown tours. <laughs> hometown dates. Home. I'm showing him my first, the house that I was brought home to when I was like first born. She remembers it vividly. Yeah. <laughs> Our nest is blessed. Is That's that what the it sign. Says? <laughs> Our nest is blessed. It is. It is blessed. The front door used to be blue. 
like a bright blue. I think. That's an interesting choice for colors. Yeah. I was like, oh, the White House. We'd always call it the White House. I remember the backyard too. I don't know why it's not divided though. It looks like there's no yeah, fence. Yeah, there's no fence on it. I was saying that. Is that how it was before? Well, it's a song uh, by Dirt. Yeah. What are the lyrics? By Dirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Some say I'm a better singer than Campaign. <laughs> Too good. Should I promo his song? Yeah, if you guys want to go check out Campaign's new song that's not even out yet, go check it out. And the, uh, I'm surprised he hasn't like made a teaser for it yet. He's a star in the making. Um, no, like truly. And he's moving to Nashville and he's ditching me. But it's okay. I'm not salty about it at all. No, not, not at, at all. all. Clearly. Traitor! <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to make a skinny margarita. We don't have any orange juice or agave. So I had to make do with honey. <laughs> and pineapple juice. Um, you know what? Not my best work, but it's fine. We got some green beans up in here. Look at those floofy rolls. <laughs> they do be floofy. We like the floofy. <laughs> we also got baked potatoes, and the dudes are out there being dudes, grilling steaks, you know, <laughs> the norm. Wow, that looks delicious. Look at it glistening. <laughs> so would you say this is your best round yet? What? No. Of steaks? No? <gasps> Round two. Yeah. Two shots of vodka. <laughs> Classic one. Ah. Ah. Mm -hmm. A lot of the butter. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Looks like a uh, pina. Pina, pina, colada. I'm using your one. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Don't forget I don't know how it's going to be. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. I like it. It's more honey, which I like. You can. We're now having a cornhole competition tournament. They're going down. We should do. Round here. Drinking that ice cold beer. 24. Isn't it 21? What's 9 plus 10? 27. You gonna play? You gonna play? He's gonna get this one. I see it, I believe in it. Rats. <laughs> Update, Wendell, my mom won. But now we're doing boys versus girls. Let's go, Madre! Okay, go ahead. <laughs> 